Pair classic L U N C triple zero is two nine at the time of this video. Uh, you can see the market caps down, trading volumes down, fully diluted market cap all down here. Um, over the last day here, kind of in the green a little bit. Last seven days in the red. The last month in the, in the green. Three months definitely in the green. But let's get into you guys some big news since the video we made earlier this morning. Want to keep this as brief as possible. Let's not waste any time, you guys. Let's just get right into it. Uh, so the big news here is that eToro did announce today. Just recently, actually, that they will be supporting the LUNC 1.2% tax off-chain. Officially, the first permanent, first major CEX to support LUNC permanently. I said something big was coming today. Like and retweet to spread the message that fire is coming. And again, go ahead and follow uh, at Classic Crypto on Twitter. Daisy does a great job of uh, just informing, giving great resourceful information on LUNC. But here's a eToro.com official screenshot from their website notice regarding the LUNC and USTC tax burn. Today, September 20th, there will be a network upgrade on Terra Classic LUNC. In order to create a fixed supply of 10 billion LUNC for every on-chain transaction, LUNC is implementing a tax of 1.2%, which is requesting to be implemented across all exchanges. This, this tax and burn mechanism will continue until a fixed supply of 10 billion LUNC is reached. Once the supply LUNC is fixed at 10 billion, the mechanism will be disabled. What does this mean for you? The burn tax and burn mechanism affects the operating costs associated with our offering of LUNC, such as September 20th. An operational fee of 0.6% will be added to eToro's bid and ask prices for LUNC on top of the standard 1% fee that is calculated when buying or selling crypto assets on eToro. So this is obviously huge news, you guys. Absolutely massive news, in my opinion. The first major CEX eToro. I mean, eToro is huge, you guys. Absolutely massive that this has happened. Um, I think Coinbase listing... Coinbase definitely looking at this like, wow, we need to relist uh, Luna Classic, obviously, now. eToro definitely making moves. I think they saw uh, an open, an opportunity for them to make this move, and they did it. And I think if you're holding LUNC, it definitely has to give you a, a very bullish outlook on it. As you can see here, from about one hour ago, we are five hours and 39, 39 minutes until the LUNC tax burn goes live. Uh, again, right here. 3,313 blocks until the tax 1.2% tax burn is active, you guys. So make sure you guys are spreading the word about this 1.2% tax burn is going crazy. And again, I think what I talked about in the previous video that the 1.2% tax burn at this current low price of Terra Classic, it being in the red, um, means you can buy more LUNC with less USD and more LUNC is thus being burned. So keep that in mind. Um, I wanted to share this tweet as well. Uh, obviously, this is just a Twitter user, but definitely interesting. I've been watching LUNC. The illustration below is 15-minute LUNC chart. LUNC just came over to the green. This means that LUNC is starting to is now starting to explode. Go about LUNC right now. If you agree, retweet, like, or like. Re go agree. If you agree, retweet or like. Obviously, this is a drawn chart here, but I think a lot of people are viewing current times here for LUNC gearing up towards a run after this 1.2% tax burn does get implemented. So make sure you guys keep that in mind here. And then also crypto.com, which we talked about earlier, is supporting the tax burn for LUNC massive as well. So crypto.com supporting it as well as eToro, both in less than 24 hours. Absolutely massive, you guys. Let me know in the comments below you guys feel about all this. I'm extremely bullish on LUNC long term. Hit the subscribe button, drop a like on this video, and as always, have a great day.